one day, this is Sir William Moore Andrew Leon, Teacher 1 from the Lampang Elementary School, your teacher presenter for today's episode of Dead Ed Tenetoluan, Grade 4 Mathematics. Our lesson for today is all about subtraction of fraction from whole number. But before that, let's have a short review about subtraction of whole number. Subtract as fast as you can. Are you ready? Let's begin. Number 1, 17 minus 12. Very good, the answer is 5. Number 2, 26 minus 15. Correct, the answer is 11. Number 3, 21 minus 7. Very good, the answer is 14. Number 4, 32 minus 23. You are right, the answer is 9. Number 5, 35 minus 19. Correct, the answer is 16. Now, let's talk about subtraction of fraction from whole number. Let's have this word problem. Mr. Soriano baked three apple pies. Her children ate five-sixths of the apple pie. How much of the pie was left? Let's see this illustration. Three minus five-sixths is equal to two and one-sixths. Let's do the subtraction. In subtracting fraction to whole number, remember these four steps. Step 1, borrow 1 from the whole number. 3 minus 1 is 2. Very good. Step 2, convert 1 into an equivalent fraction with same denominator to the given fraction. 1 is equal to 6 over 6. Step 3, subtract the given fraction from the equivalent fraction you converted. 6 over 6 minus 5 over 6 is 1 over 6. Step 4, add the result from step 1 and step 3. 2 plus 1 6 is 2 and 1 6. Let's have another example. Father bought 2 kilograms of fruits from the market. He gave 5 eighths kilograms to his helper. How many kilograms of fruits were left for his family? Let's do the subtraction. 2 minus 5 eighths. Step 1, borrow 1 from the whole number portion. 2 minus 1 is 1. You are right. Step 2, convert 1 into an equivalent fraction with same denominator to the given fraction. 1 is equal to 8 over 8. Very good. Step 3, subtract the given fraction from the equivalent fraction you converted. 8 over 8 minus 5 over 8 is Correct, 3 over 8. Step 4, add the result from step 1 and step 3. 1 plus 3 eighths is equal to 1 and 3 eighths. Let's have another one. Randy bought one whole cartolina. He shared 3 eighths of it with friends. What part of cartolina was left for him? Let's do the subtraction. 1 minus 5 eighths. Step 1, borrow 1 from the whole number portion. 1 minus 1 is 0. Very good. Step 2. Convert 1 into an equivalent fraction with same denominator to the given fraction. 1 is equal to 8 over 8. Step 3. Subtract the given fraction from the equivalent fraction you converted. 8 over 8 minus 5 8 is 3 over 8. Very good. Step 4. Add the result from step 1 and step 3. 0 plus 3 eighths is 3 eighths. Very good. Again, how to subtract fraction from whole number? Step 1, borrow 1 from the whole number portion. Step 2, convert 1 into an equivalent fraction with same denominator to the given fraction. Step 3, subtract the given fraction from the equivalent fraction you converted. Step 4, add the result of step 1 and step 3. Now, it's your turn. Read and solve the following problems. Number 1. Mother divided a cassava cake into 16 equal parts. Her children ate 7 over 16. How much cake was left? Number 2. From 10 meters of wire, 3 fourth was cut. How many meters of wire were left? Number 3. If 5 over 12 is subtracted from 5, what is the difference? The answer in number 1 is 7 over 16 
of Kasama K. The answer in number 2 is 9 and 1 fourth meters of wire. The answer in number 3 is 4 and 7 twelfths. That ends our lesson for today. Again, I am Sir Villamor Ardeleon, your teacher presenter for today.